Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If it's your first time here, my name is Tony Ann and this is the second episode of Dreaming Colour. With everything going on, I thought, let me just have some fun and some colourful looks. So if you want to see what I come up with today, then just continue watching. I'm going to start with my primer, which is the Smashbox Primerizer. Next, I'm going to put on foundation using the Fenty Beauty Pro Filter in 420, the original. Just going to... Okay, next for concealer, I'm using the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in Tan and put foundation on my hand. I just put a little bit on my finger and Robert Welsh says to drop a little bit there, there and there. He says that should be enough. And just blend it out the don't mind my under eyes going into a sunken place, but I'm shook. Maybe I don't need so much concealer. Okay. <laughs> Next thing I'm going to do is powder. Use the True Colour Black Opal Finishing Powder in the shade Dark. I do this when I want my makeup to last me, like if I'm going to work like a full shift. So I do it around the small lines. And I know this foundation is quite matte anyway, but you know during the day when you're all out, and your natural oils and stuff start to come through. This, you know, helps save the makeup. So next, I'm gonna go into my Banana Deep Powder by Makeup Revolution. Pop that on my under eye. Just press it in. Sometimes I would use that exact amount for just one, I mean both sides of my eye, sometimes for just one, especially when my eyes are very sunken like they are right now, I'll use a lot more powder to try and combat that. Next we're going to do brows, just going to brush out my brows. My high brow gel in medium brown and just set it into place. My brows have grown back in so I could actually just leave them like that but because I'm extra I'm going to draw around it. So I'm just gonna align, draw a line at the bottom and at the top And just slightly brush it through my brow. It's giving me that feathered brow sort of look. Yeah, I like that. Then just go brush it out with spoolie. Hmm. I think I may conceal here, but I'm just going to use like literally the tiniest amount and just conceal under my brows. Just using the same concealer I use for my under eye. Popping the concealer onto my A18 brush. It's a little bit bigger than what I was going for, but it will work. And what I do, I just start a little bit lower than my brow. And gradually build it up. Ooh, that's a 
pretty brow and I'm just going to blend it down okay now I'm going to bronze using Coco Naughty by Fenty Beauty wait can I see the bottom? I use this a lot also if I want it to be a little bit sharper so you can see the then I use a little bit of powder, my face powder, and take a turn, eat a little bit. And just apply it underneath. Could do a little bit more than that. Yeah, so yeah, just so you guys can see, it's there. And then I'm using my MAC blush, which is called Burnt Pepper. Probably should have done so much, but <sighs> we're going for colour. Rosy. <laughs> so I'm going to go in with highlight. I'm using the Dust Till Dawn palette and Revolution X Patricia Bright. And I'm gonna go in. It's like a shooting star. <laughs> Blend everything all together. I'm just gonna use my Morphe Continuous Setting Spray. Oh, this is my fave. And then use my. Real Technique sponge to press it in. Okay, last, well not last, but finally what you came for, the eyeshadow look. I'm just going to use my NYX eye base in white. Today I'm going to be using the Be Perfect Cosmetics Trendy in Tokyo palette. And I'm going to start with the shade Emoji. So my outer corner. And with this look, I would say just follow the shape of your eye. So you know when you look down and you see that round shape there, just follow that. Patting it in for now before I start blending it. And then now I'm going to start blending out the edge. I'll just blend it up closer to the eyebrow. And then at the front, I'm going to go into Fortune, which is the light blue right there. And this time, I'm just going to start by blending it out straight away and then packing the shade onto the lid and blend it into Emoji. And tapping it onto the lid. I'm just going to go back into Emoji and blend into fortune yeah that's better final shade I'm gonna use is Saki Saki I'm not sure how you say it just with a flat brush shimmer shade pop it in the middle now because it's not shimmering the way I would like it to shim I'm just gonna spray my brush so I just got a little bit more on the brush and it's a bit better. Oh, a lot better. And now we're going to work on softening the edges of Saki into the first two shades we laid down. I'm going to go back into the first two shades. First emoji, the pink. And then next, fortune. Okay, because I'm extra, I want to add one more thing. My collection Glam Crystals Gel Liner in 
cosmic stars i'm gonna add it right to the middle sort of an iridescent color that has pink blue and purple shimmer in it and then i'm just gonna use my finger finger to soften up the edges a little bit of that shimmer And I'm just going to go back in the sake, the shimmery purple, just add it around the middle section again. Okay, lashes are on and they are She's Fire in Tatty Lashes, X Pretty Little Thing. So hard to put on, I even want to talk about it. <laughs> okay, so finally we're going to do lips, so I'm going to use my LA Girl lip liner in chocolate okay oh my lips are so dry mm -mm. Mm -mm. <laughs> and I'm gonna use my line crime liquid lips in Virgo and Neptune so I'm gonna start with Neptune shade I'm gonna pop it on my A15 brush and apply it. I'm honestly addicted to using lip brushes now. I'd never understood the purpose of them, but now I, I'm awakened. <laughs> and then I'm gonna use a little bit of Virgo right in the middle. I'm going to go back in with the lip liner, mm -mm, the dryness that my lips are right now is a sham, rub it together, so that's a bit matte, using Fenty Glow, Thank you so much for watching let me know what you think about the look down below don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i will see you guys next time bye